Hi, and welcome back to my channel, y'all. We're gonna go into Goodwill today, but uh, first I wanna say thank you so much. We're at 950 subscribers right now. I need 50 more <laughs> to get monetized. I am so proud of this community. Everybody's so nice. Everybody who comments, everybody is like, you know, helpful or friendly, and I love that. I was scared to even start this journey at all because I thought I'd get a lot of hate or, you know, whatever. But I just want to say thank you so much <laughs> to everyone. And we're going to go in and we see buy and sell online. Let's go. Happy Monday, y'all. So we made it back to the hard goods, crowded as usual <laughs> lately. So we're just trying to pick a spot where we can look. That is the plastic section, $2.99. It does have some wear on the inside. And I know that some of these you can't sell, but I don't know which ones you can't because some of them have been recalled. And it says made in Taiwan. And I don't know which ones had the recall on it. But $2.99 for that's a good price. Down the toy section, my kid's favorite. <laughs> that little genie was $1.99. I thought that was going to be a Madame Alexander doll. I'm probably saying that wrong. But it wasn't. That's $3.99. Puzzles. We're looking back here for that cross stitch stuff, but I don't see any today. And the cross stitch stuff I don't sell. I keep. That's $4.99. I thought it was going to be a single, you know, like little cup, but it's glued together. <laughs> I don't know if they came like that or somebody just glued it. Those are those McDonald's cups. I don't think they have much of a resell anymore. And then all of the plates and cups are supposed to be 99 cents. That's $4.99 for the cow. That's cute. And then a Marilyn Monroe. It's $4.99, which I don't like that price, especially for a mug. But they said, <laughs> Goodwill, whoever put this out, they're probably like, that one's probably worth money. Let's make it a $4.99. I like this one, but I'm pretty sure it's missing a lid. I'm like, it says made in France, all other components made in Germany. But this little hook thing looks like it might have had a metal lid on it. Kind of like a beer stein. It's 99 cents, but I did leave it because I'm pretty sure that's broken. That's $3.99. It does have a little bit of a chip. But I like the strawberry design. I will let it ride in the buggy. It's a little container full of marbles. $6.99. That's really lightweight and there's marbles on the inside. This part was heavy because of all the marbles. I'll let it ride, but I'm not sure on that, and I don't, I'm not sure on the $6.99 price. And I have noticed that they have raised the prices, and I'm pretty sure it's because of the quote-unquote extra discounts, but math ain't mathin' for me. If you keep the prices high... <laughs> I don't know. That was a little honey pot, but I'm going to look that one up. I'm not sure on that one just yet. And that's $5.99. So it's cute. $3.99. A little snail on the top. He's cute. Probably say that a lot. <laughs> oh, 
All right, I love that jewelry box. I'm pretty sure it's what it is. It's $5.99. And it says Incole. I don't know how to say that, but it's like a stone. Somebody's earrings were left in here. It's really heavy. But this is a gorgeous piece. Little cherubs. It's like textured. It's really nice. I know that price is high, but I'm pretty sure that's a good pickup. Little watermelon salt and pepper shakers. And those were being sold separate, you know, two different prices on each. It's $1.99 Avon. <laughs> Was a little bit dusty. <laughs> $2.99 on that tile. Whole bunch of clear glass down there, just like little bowls. My kids found a Nerf gun, put it in the buggy. And that's a little lampshade for, you know, your little candle holders. And they've brought out a whole bunch of more Christmas stuff because this used to have the Halloween section on it. It's $3.99. Little snowman. I did put him back. Little nativity scene. It does say made in China. $2.99 on the little Santa. I think I have one of these already. It's $2.99. Little candle holder. I'm gonna let it ride though. Then I'll see. And see if it has any damage. I'm really excited about that jewelry box though. And this little Santa was super heavy. He didn't have a flat surface on the bottom. So it was like he would, you know, kind of move. And he didn't have a price that I could see. And I was doing it with one hand. Didn't want to drop him. That's $3.99. There's a little Santa. But like as a post office worker, you know, <laughs> mail carrier. $2.99, a little Christmas tree. And that I thought was going to be a heavier piece, but it's plastic, not glass. And now we're hooked on the shelf. <laughs> they still have some pumpkins out. That's $5.99. Now we're trying to go down the next aisle. Without breaking anything. <laughs> There's some more of those glasses. I'm thinking about keeping these ones though, because I already have some for sale. I have two sets for sale, but I kind of want to keep some. Because I didn't last year. Last year I just sold them. But I think this year I want to keep a few. You know, like five. <laughs> those were plastic, those little dishes. I thought they were going to be glass. They rearranged the metal section. Now it's on this side. It's $4.99. $2.99. So some of the stuff is good priced and some of the stuff, I wonder if they research it. I don't know. I love this yellow teapot or tea kettle. It's $4.99. It is made in Japan. It's a gorgeous color. I like yellow. That's not my favorite color. It is dirty on the inside. And a little bit of rust. It's not terrible. But 
That yellow is really pretty. That'd be really cool. That teapot in, you know, like a retro kitschy kitchen. That'd be really cute. Definitely wouldn't drink out of that. <laughs> but cute for decorations. And that's $6.99. Now, that's probably a good price if you don't want to pay the, you know, home goods or target price. That's $3.99. I didn't see any brand on that one. And this one's $3.99 as well, but it is recycled glass. I can tell it's really thick and textured. It's got like the little feet at the bottom. Underneath that $3.99 sticker, it does say Spain. So I think that's a good pickup. And then there's this. This is probably, that's $4.99. I wonder if it's recycled glass as well, but I do put that one back because it is larger. $3.99. 75 percent off the blue tag and 50 percent off yellow. So I think I do have a few yellow things in the buggy. And that's a bookend. I thought it was like a cowbell. <laughs> it's $3.99. My favorite section, the wood and the little baskets. This is cute. It's $3.99. Like a little cabin. They were each $3.99. I do leave those behind. Probably could have picked them up, but I think that would do better on like Etsy. $3.99 on the little music box. They have some little gnomes down at the bottom. They're like Valentine's Day themed. Some Easter baskets. And then this is totally random, but next week my husband and I are going on vacation. We have never taken a vacation. And we've been together for 11 years. <laughs> so we're going to Vegas to go watch a Raider game. And we are super excited. So if y'all have ever been to Vegas and y'all know things to do down there that are, you know, not like just gambling. But definitely let me know. I've been like looking stuff up. <laughs> we're pretty excited. I love these kind of planners, but it's $3.99, and they've got them each at $3.99, and those came from the Dollar Tree. So, <laughs> they're really thin plastic, and those used to be $1.25, and now they got them at $3.99 each. Just trying to do a double, check down the aisles where I couldn't look earlier. So I only go thrifting twice a week, sometimes only once, and that's $14.99. <laughs> I feel like that's a regular price from a regular store. I don't know what that green stuff is. $2.99. I wonder if it used to be the old felt at the bottom. They rearranged this aisle as well. That says cookies. It is $5.99. Trying to open it with one hand. At the bottom it says all gone. I don't know. I'll look it up, but it does have some wear. And you know, I have everything else in the buggy that's not low priced. <laughs> You know, everything adds up. It's a little plaque. Y'all can pause and read. That's a little box container. I don't know what used to go in there. And I have no clue what this thing is. It's $3.99. It doesn't stand up on its own. 
Maybe it stands up on the other way, like on its side. I don't know. Or maybe it was not. <laughs> it is on its side right now, right? And if you flip it over, right? <laughs> That's $2.99. I do like this. It is wood. Maybe a candle holder or a vase. Like this one as well, but I'm pretty. That's four ninety nine. That's high. And I'm pretty sure that's a transfer. Like glued on. And it's all chipped. So put that one back, and I'm gonna pick up this one. And it is two ninety nine. With a yellow tag. I got quite a few things in the buggy that I need to do comps for. I like this little turkey. He's $2.99. He's 75% off because it's blue tag. I wanted him last time and I don't know why I didn't pick him up, but now it's 75% off, so I pick him up. And it's just a little lid for your glass candy jars. They still have those little votive holder things. That's $3.99. Definitely newer. I do like that color though. That's my favorite color. The light pink. We are going to do comps and then I'll head back home and I'll show you what I'll pick up. Alright y'all, we are back home. Y'all already know. I did pick up this even though it was $4.99. The comps were really good on this one. Um, but the ones that were selling had a box. Mine doesn't have the box, so I just lowered the price a little bit, and I did go ahead and get this one listed. And they were selling for about 50 with the box, so I put it at 40 because it doesn't have the box. So I think that's why that was priced the way it is. I think somebody who is pricing, especially when it's got the handwritten price, I think somebody's researching it. And this was $4.99 as well. And I did see comps for about 40 on these ones. Now it does have some damage on the lid, which I didn't really check. I literally just looked on the inside and called it good. But I still think it's fine because the ones I did see that were selling had chips on the inside and on the outside. And this doesn't have any chips on the outside. It is dirty and it does need cleaned. And it does say Japan at the bottom. I don't know if y'all saw that in the video earlier. It is dirty on the bottom, but that's okay. Now this one, this one I'm so happy for. So I did see ones that, you know, sold for 70, but they were smaller than the one I have. So I did go ahead and get this one listed and I cleaned it all up. It was all dusty and I did get it cleaned. It does say genuine. I don't know how to say that, but that's what it is. <laughs> and I love this orange, you know, little mat down in here. And it does have the brand on the back. Hold on. I'll show you. It's kind of heavy, especially with one hand. It does say it right there as well, just not very well. And I did try to get this all cleaned up as best as I could. It is really pretty. Really nice. That was loud. I did pick up this one as well. And it is from Spain. I already took the tag off this one because I got it listed. Um, it is that recycled glass. And these sell for about 30, 25 to 30. It's really heavy. It's probably about two pounds, you know, for a votive holder that's heavy. And this one, this one is chrysanthemum wood. I don't know how to say that. I don't know if it's going to pick up on the tag, but like in person, you can read it. And when I did research on it, they're made in Japan. You can kind of see that CH. I don't know if you can read it. But these things sell for about 30 just on itself, just by itself. 
So that was a good pickup for $2.99. I did pick up the glasses again, but I'm thinking about I'm thinking about keeping them. I'm just gonna pick up two more so that way I could have five, you know, one for each of us. Now my younger kids will not be drinking out of them because I don't want them to break them. But I do like them. And then I did pick up the little turkey. He's so cute. $2.99, but it was 75% off. And that is everything that I got today. I hope everyone's having a great day, great Monday. If you're watching this and it's not a Monday, I still hope you're having a great day. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe.